Assalamu alaikum everyone, this is Nusrat Naihan Fatima and this video is going to be about evolutionary trend in trilobite. Trilobite evolved during their existence. Depending on evolution, they changed their morphology in many stages and got divided into species gradually. Trilobite is a sea creature that was dominant in Paleozoic era and basically an ancient arthropod. Its morphology is divided into cephalon, thoracic, and pygidium. Depending on their early to adult life, evolutionary trends can be divided into pedomorphic tendencies and paramorphic trends. Due to change of their cephalon, eye size, segment of thorax, we can differentiate them. And this is how their evolutionary trend follows on. In this picture, the eye size of the trilobite reduces. It was a benthic trilobite living in dim light. Absence of the light led them to reduce die size and turning them blind to nearly blind. In some trilobite, surface details got smoother, like cephalon, pygidial, and thoracic furrows got smoothened out. That caused some problems in identification of some species. Then we come to miniaturization. The segments of thorax or whole trilobite got smaller in size. If progenesis is present in the trilobite species, then miniaturization occurs in thoracic segment. And also, the size of the trilobite and maturity is related. Like, if the trilobite is matured early, it will be smaller in its adulthood. Spinocity is development of spines in trilobite. Spines may be part of exoskeleton. Their spine helps them to stabilize their body or to swim slowly in any environment. In case of pelagic morphology, the trilobite shown in the picture, they evolved their body to survive in the sea. They evolved according to their swimming strength. This evolution led to elongation of their body and eyes, covering their whole cephalon indicating eye enlargement. For trilobites present in low oxygen environment or high sulfur concentration environment, they let some sulfur consuming bacteria live in themselves. So both kind of created a symbiotic relationship between them. In some species, it caused increased number of thoracic segment. Some trilobites evolved due to the filter feeding. To feed themselves, they had to expand their cephalon or holes in cephalon by which they can filter feed. To stabilize their body during filter feeding, genal spines or genal prolongations were notable, which later became important for species identification. This was an overall idea about the evolutionary trends in trilobite. Hope these informations were helpful to you. Thank you.